Campbell Lights Up project is just really cool. It really highlights some of the architecture and some of the public art in the space. It brings to light the certain aspects of Nambour that you might miss just driving through. Art in public spaces really just embraces what the community has to say about that area. My art piece, Fire in the Heart, came from my love of Nambour as a child. It also references a sugar mill history here. Each piece is welded as a segment of sugar cane. The Bunya Nut has a huge importance to this area. That's why me and Miles Allen really wanted to create this piece. The history throughout the area, the First Nations people that would have the Bunya Festival just down the road and they would carry the Bunya Nuts for trade and from the Black Hole Range down. It's such an important aspect and to represent that through an art form is just really special. I'm Mike Black and I'm a creative technologist. Having art that's accessible to everyone inspires that engagement, that connection, the feeling of belonging to a community. It encourages people to explore local businesses around that area and follow art trails. It has been interesting to watch people walk past and then suddenly see that it does light up and stop and take a closer look and that's the whole point of the public art. That kind of intervention can actually alter someone's perception of the world or however it might provoke questions. Light installations can transform a space. They can accentuate existing architecture that is beautiful in its own right. All these things bring tourism dollars, jobs and opportunities to a region. I believe the end goal of any public art is to bring attention to the beauty that's there and express the community that sits behind all that and to tell publicly, standing on the rooftop, name and lights, I'm here and I want to be interacted with. <laughs>